Till now in hashing, I already discussed direct address table, hash table, hash function, then collision resolution technique. We can handle collision in two ways. One is chaining, another is open addressing. In chaining, we store multiple keys in single slot by using the linked list. Whereas in open addressing, we use three techniques. First is linear probing, second is quadratic probing and double hashing for handling the collision. Let's solve one question for all open addressing technique like linear probing, quadratic probing and double hashing. This question is from Corman book. It's in exercise 11.41. Consider inserting the keys 10, 22, 31, 4, 15, 28, 17, 88, 59 into a hash table of length m equals to 11 using open addressing with the auxiliary hash function h dash k equals to k. Illustrate the result of inserting these keys using linear probing, using quadratic probing with c1 equals to 1 and c2 equals to 3 and using double hashing with h1 k equals to k and h2 k equals to 1 plus k mod m minus 1. First I will solve using linear probing. In linear probing hash function is h of k i equals to h dash k plus i mod m and here h dash k given is k. So h of k i will be k plus i mod 11 as m equals to 11. We will create a hash table and index will be from 0 to 10 as m equals to 11. Index start from 0 till m minus 1. So 0 to 10. First 10 divide 11. Remainder will be 10. We will insert 10 at index 10. Next 22 divide 11. Remainder is 0. We will insert 22 at index 0. Next 31, 31 divide 11, reminder is 9. We will insert 31 at index 9. Next 4 divide 11, reminder is 4. We will insert 4 at index 4. Next 15 divide 11, reminder is 4. In 4, already 4 is there, so there will be collision. Whenever there will be collision, we will use linear probing. So 15 plus 1, k is 15, 15 plus i, first we will take i equals to 1, then 2, then 3, up to m minus 1. So 15 plus 1 mod 11, it's 16 mod 11, it's 5. Here it's given h dash k equals to k, generally h dash k is the first hash value. If it's not written h dash k equals to k, then we will consider 4 plus 1 mod 11. This 4 plus 1, it will be 5. Ultimately, you will get same result. Now, fifth slot is empty. So, we will insert 15 at slot 5. Next, 28 divide 11. Reminder is 6. 28 minus 22, it's 6. Sixth slot is empty. So, we can insert 28 on sixth slot. Next, 17 divide 11. Reminder is 6. 6 is already filled. So, we will do 17 plus 1 mod 11, 7. 7 is empty. So, we will insert 17 at slot 7. Next, 88 divide 11. Reminder is 0. 0 slot is already filled. So, we will find 88 plus 1, 89 mod 11, 1. We will insert at slot 1. Simply, you can check next free slot. 0 is filled. Next free slot is 1, we will insert 88 at slot 1. Next 59, 59 divide 11, reminder is 4, 4 is already filled. Next 59 plus 1, 60 mod 11, reminder is 5, 5 is already filled. Next 59 plus 2, I value will increase, here I was 1, now I is 2. 59 plus 2 mod 11, it's 6. Sixth slot is also filled. Next 59 plus 3 mod 11, it's 7. Seventh is also filled. So 59 plus 4 mod 11, it's 8. 8 is empty. So I'll insert 59 at slot 8. For inserting key 59, we did 4 attempt or you can say probe. 
First we check fourth index, then fifth index, then sixth index, then seven index. In next lecture, I will solve same question by quadratic probing. If this lecture is helpful for you, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.